My introductory remarks today is that if the old mistake was to underestimate China's rise and dynamism, then the new mistake would be to overestimate the extent of China's new normal, the slowdown. The IMF predicts that China will grow by 6.3% in 2016. That's almost double, of course, the latest IMF predictions for the world as a whole of 3.2%. At the recent National People's Congress in Beijing, the government, as you know, announced a commitment to keep growth at 6.5% right through to 2020. And we need to put 6.5% in context. Um, as was pointed out at our recent Canberra Networking Day, uh, ACBC Networking Day in Canberra, every percentage point of GDP growth today in China is worth 2.6 percentage points a decade ago. And so even if China was growing just 6% today, it would be 15% plus a decade ago. And I think we'd be jumping up so high we'd be just about hitting the roof. Another way of thinking of it, obviously, China's base is so much larger, so much larger. Six and a half percent today off an economic base of US $11 trillion is a 